Judge, today's case is Alpha Man. She's young, she's scared, and he's controlling. Let's see if I can get through to this self-proclaimed alpha male. Court is now in session. The Honorable Judge Lynn Toler presiding. Good day, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here today with Mark Santel and Angelina Uno Peak. The two of you have been together for two years, uh, but you do not want to be together anymore. Mr. Santel, you are suing Ms. Uno Peak for $800 for the cost of a cell phone, and we will get to that momentarily. But before we do, Ms. Uno Peak, I'm going to speak with you first. Why don't you tell me a little bit about your relationship and why we're here today? Well, Your Honor, Mark always try to call the shots, but he can't afford to be the boss because I'm the one that makes all the money. <laughs> I go to work from 11 p.m. to 4 a.m., and the first thing I do is I hand him everything I made that night. Right when I get home, he tells me he wants a massage. He's so controlling that he made me give our daughter up for adoption. She said, he said it was him or her, and I chose him. Wow. Oh, my. I can't even How have How long any ago friends. was that? Well, she's nine months, so it was about nine months ago. Nine months ago. How did that conversation go? Well... What did you say, Mr. Santel? Well, what did I you mean, say? It sounds bad but yes, by the does. way she's saying it. But, I mean, at the time, we were both homeless, right? We, we, we were living at a friend's house. Uh-huh. And, like, I didn't have a job. She didn't have a job. I mean... She was she she had run away from home and everything. Like we we didn't we, you we didn't have in, anything. We were in a position to have a baby. Right. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, I'm controlling, but for a reason. You feel me? Because if I let her do certain things, it's gonna come back and bite me in the ass. Like she talking about I don't let her out, right? But if I let her out, every time she come back, she come back with a story. Like for your example. Honor, he, your Honor, I don't. You don't let her out. <laughs> when, 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 when she when, when I let her out, she always come back with a story. Like for example. Oh, she, I let her out with her friends, right? It was three girls and three guys, right? Two of her friends walked off with two guys and left her in the car with the guy, right? Guy touching on her, trying to, you know, have sex with her and everything. Right. Right? I had to come back and find out about that. Your Honor, he's lying. I found out he was dating a prostitute the whole time I was pregnant. I was not dating a prostitute. He was paying her for her hotel room and everything. And he didn't tell me. I found, I just found this out. I feel like... All right, so she was gone when she was pregnant. The, the entire course of her pregnancy, she was in a program. And so I feel like everything that happened in that period of time is like a gray area. Because when she left, she gave me permission to go do things with other girls because I didn't know how long she was going to be gone. And she loves to get on her high horse about, oh, I did this with this girl when, I, when she was pregnant. But that whole time, she was in a relationship with a guy in the program with her. She loves to blame me for everything, but she'd she be doing the same stuff. You feel me? Mizuno Peak, even with Adam, do you think you make good decisions? Yes, I think I make good decisions with Adam. There's just a list of rules that I have to follow um, every single day when I'm with him. What's the list of rules? Do we have them? Mark's rules of order. Yeah. I am the alpha male and I will be respected as such as all time. You didn't really do that, did you? <laughs> <laughs> she I mean, made that up just to entertain me, right? I mean, I, I am the alpha in, in, in the house. Just because I feel like. She can't make good decisions on her own. She don't got the skills to. She talking about finances. If I didn't control the money, she would blow all Your Honor, money that's on not true. Stuff. I got, but we would be broke if I let her true. control I, the money. I received three thousand dollars from my from, from one of my family members, and I asked him if I could get a forty dollar piercing. And you and made he that said, she said, made that deal. He said she I could get it if he got a twenty six hundred dollar bike. That was her and idea. And he decided to do it. He he went he went along with it. He did, did you get it. a twenty six hundred dollar bike? She, all right. Y'all just thinking, fresh off the street trying I, to make it, and you got a $2,600 bike, because, and you mad at her because she made a, wanted a $40 piercing? I mean, you didn't, need the, not, you didn't need either one of those things, but, oh, Lord, how stupid is that? Because I had been wanting a bike. I had been wanting a bike for a while. So I want a yacht. I don't go out and buy but, one. But she, she, she knew that. Like, so? So she, she made a deal with me. If I let her get a piercing, she let me get a bike. But you say you make good decisions. You're blaming her well, that was for the extra money. No, 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 stop, I'm talking. I said you said you make good decisions and that she doesn't. And you're claiming that getting a $2,600 bike in your financial circumstance was a good decision. And I'm saying that ain't. Well, it didn't, it, we didn't spend any of the money that we were getting from our incomes. It was just the extra money that we had. There is no for. extra money. You're 19. You don't have any extra money. <laughs> you don't have a home. You know what I mean? You were just off the street. You don't have extra money. 
Do you she, hear me? She be, waste, she be wasting money, too. If I no, give her... No, uh-uh, uh-uh. You the alpha male, you answer for what you do. <laughs> no, you cannot open your own bank account. No, you cannot go out without my permission. Did you say all of that? Yeah, and like I said, if I, if I let her out, she always come back with a story. Mm -hmm. Do not go to sleep until I'm ready for bed. We must be on the same schedule and be equally tired. And like, do not purchase, she, she I am talking, Mr. Santel. Do not purchase foods that I don't eat. Do not buy fruits and vegetables. It's a waste of money. <laughs> I, will, well, I let her. I, I let her get. I, I, I just the other day when I went to a grocery store, right, like like a month ago. Uh, I had bought lettuce and apples and everything. She ate one of those apples, right? Two of them still sitting in the fridge right now. The That's lettuce that I bought, moldy. I had to throw it, I had to throw it out before well, I... Well, why don't you eat those apples? I don't, I don't, I don't really eat fruits. fruits or vegetables. You might need to start. <laughs> <laughs> Wash the dishes immediately after you cook before you eat. Your phone privileges will be taken if you abuse your phone. Do not get guys' numbers at work. Do not purchase clothes without my permission. Did you say all of those things? Well, if she, if I, if I let her just have money, she's gonna go to the store and blow it all on clothes or ice cream or... Or a $2,600 buy. That's bike. not true. <laughs> that was That's not true. That was actually what? You still think that makes sense, don't you? Well, I, I feel like, because it didn't, like, affect our ability to pay bills. So it wasn't like, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, it did. It didn't. It didn't it affect did. our. It didn't affect our ability to pay yeah, bills. Yeah, but it's my money. It's you my made the money. She made the deal. It was her idea. It wasn't my idea. She was like, if you yeah, want to get it. Yeah, but you know what? Advice. You said you say you're the alpha male, but as soon as I call you on a decision that's bad, you claim it was her decision, and you made a deal. So since she made the deal, it was a good decision. Do you see what I'm saying there? You see how much trouble you in here, Mr. Santel? Do you get that part? <laughs> You see how this thing's gonna go for you? <laughs> Say something that will make me like you. <laughs> Anything. Say something positive. Say something about how kind you are, what you do for your woman, or, or how you make anything better. He was nice enough to let me have 10% of my money so I could buy something for his birthday. <laughs> Did you do that, Mr. Santel? It's not just that. If she make ones, I let her keep the ones. I mean, I don't, I don't want a pocket full of ones. She, she, she a stripper. So I, I, don't, I don't want all, of, all them ones in my pocket. Your Honor, one day I had given him my money and he had spent it all and threw it all on a stripper that same It was night. like $5. She, it was she exaggerating, bro. It was like $5. Say something that will make me like you. <laughs> Anything. Say something positive. Say something about how kind you are, what you do for your woman, or, or how you make anything better. I mean, you know, I'm, I'm, always, I'm always there for her. She need me. You know what I'm saying? In what respect? She needed to get her GED. She, she didn't finish high school. I didn't finish high school either. But I had got my GED. And I was, I had pushed her to get her GED. You know, I was with her when she was doing the practice test and everything and, and helping her study and everything. She got her GED, you know what I'm saying? Well, I'm, um, I'm happy. That's a good one. That, that, that was a very good one. Did he, he help you get your GED? Yes, he did, Your Honor. Why do you stay with him? Because I love him. Oh, that. <laughs> if you weren't with him, what do you think you'd be doing? I'd probably be... Honestly, I don't know. I'd probably be in a bad place. You say she's always trying to make you jealous. What do you mean by that? I, so, like, if we get into a fight, so start talking to guys on the dating app. Mm -hmm. Or um, one time for Valentine's Day, right, I spent the whole day with her. But at night, I wanted to go out to the club, like to the club with my friends or whatever. Mm -hmm. So she got mad, so she... You're 19, what kind of club can you get into? <laughs> I, just, I just paid a bounce, but it's, it's straight. Like, all right, so she, <laughs> she went out, she, so I had went out to the club with my friends and then I came back. Find out she had went out with this guy off of her Snapchat or whatever. 
they they was hanging out, or whatever. Ended up like kissing or something on Valentine's Day. She she be doing stuff like that all the time. Like she be doing things just just to make me mad. Yeah. You know, Mizuno Peak, did you do that? Well, I did, but at the end of the day, I've only been with him this whole relationship. I never slept with anybody else, and he has. But every time she has he slept with how many people has he slept with? He slept with at least ten people. She lied. At she least. Lie. It was at like, least it was ten like people. three or four. Three no, or he, four he, people. Why is it okay for you to sleep with three or four people, but she can't go out on a date with one? It was because she like every time that like that happened, she was gone. And she had told me before she left that I could. That's she was not gone true. for nine months. That yes, is you not did. true. That's yet, not true. She told me I could That's before not she true. left. Can I, let me ask you this, Miz, Mizuno Peak. Do you have family? Do you have do you have people that are in your corner? I have family, but But are they in your corner? Not really. So he's kind of like the default dude? Well, yeah, I love him now. Are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. I'm worried about you. I'm concerned. If you would like your case to be heard on Divorce Court, call us toll-free at 1-877-311-2222 or log on to our website at divorcecourt.com. Miss the show? Watch full episodes on our streaming platforms and for exclusive content, go to Apple TV. When you I'm say do, do your part, what do you mean by do your part? He what, what, do. He I mean, all right, so ours. right now I'm not working, so I'm, I'm basically taking care of the house. When I was working and she wasn't, I expected her to take care of the house. And right? that wasn't happening. And that wasn't happening. <laughs> and I was the one cooking, cleaning, everything. She didn't do nothing but stay in bed all day. Were you in bed a lot? Yes, I was. I was... Are you okay? Yes, I'm okay. I'm worried about you. I'm concerned. Do you ever worry about her? I mean, sometimes... You see, you, you seem to be annoyed by her behavior. But do you ever worry about why it is she stays in bed all day? It's not normal for an 18-year-old. I know her background, so, like... Her background is probably not the best. I don't think people took good care of her. Is that true? Yeah. Ms. Uno Peak, what do you want him to do? I want to know how I can make this okay for you. You see, she's crying there, right? Do you know why? Um, no. Nah. You don't know why? I mean, I didn't say anything that was a lie or bad about her. It, it, it got nothing to do with you. That's not why she's crying, not crying because you did something mean to her. She's crying because she's sticking with a dude that's trying to be all alpha male, this, that, and the other, and she feels like she doesn't have any options or any power. She's crying because she's hurt. She's crying because she doesn't feel safe. She's crying because she's scared. That's why she's crying. What would you like him to change if I could get him to change one thing? I would want him to... Put me first. Think about me. Like, sometimes he'd be saying stuff and, like, it what hurts What kind of me. things does he say? Like, I know the other day I said I wanted... I said I wanted a belly piercing, and he told me that I was fat, so... And it's just like... I did not tell you. I did he not did tell, tell me that. When and he's say? told me that many times. Bro, I... All right, first of all, I... Like... I used to joke around with her, like, you know, like, when somebody eat up everything out of the kitchen, you say they'd be a fat ass. Outside, that was, that was a joke. I wasn't literally calling her fat. I, you can't it was, joke it was with like, women about their weight, period, end of story. I understand that now, so that's why I don't do it no more, you feel right. me? Like, I, but what I, did you say the other day when she said she wanted a belly piercing? I, so, so I said if she wanted to wear a belly piercing, she should just, like, work out so that she could look her best in it, mm -hmm. you feel me? Well, I, it wasn't meant to hurt her. It was meant to, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I, yeah, I, I hear you. <coughs> I hear you. You're young, uh, so I'm gonna give you a second on that one. Never tell a woman she, her body ain't right. And you know what I mean? Just don't do it. It, it, it doesn't feel good.
Mr. Santel, I don't think you're a bad guy. I don't think you're a particularly mature guy. I don't think that you are as together as you believe you are. I believe you love her. But I also believe that you're selfish and immature mm -hmm. and that you have a great deal of obligation on your shoulders. Ms. Uno Peak has been through some things. I don't know what they are, but I know they were there. You know what they are, I don't, but I can tell. And she's broken into pieces. And if you're gonna take on somebody who's broken into pieces, you can't continue to kick her. When you tell her she needs to work out because she's too chubby, you kick her. When you tell her she can't go here and can't go there and do this, that, and the other, you kick her. It's about being a warm, comforting, cherishing uh, person to a person who's already had a lot of bad things happen to her. And if you can't be that guy, you need to become that guy, because she deserves that guy. Yeah. Are you with me? I feel you. Do you? <laughs> yeah. Mizuno Peak, I think you are an absolutely beautiful young lady. You're young, you've been through a lot, and the, and, and, and the only thing I'm quite sure of is you survived in one piece. And here you are, beautiful, working, doing your thing, and I'm so proud of you for that. You do not have to take, take orders from anybody. I want you to stop focusing on what's happening with your body, with piercings and all that kind of stuff, and focus on your future, your education, what you need to get done. Because, you know, as dark as life may have been so far, it can be bright and beautiful for a long time to come. Now. Having said that, I'm gonna say this. I ain't give him any money. <laughs> not happening. You working, he not working, not giving him a dime. Anyway, y'all not leaving each other. But what I am gonna do is I'm gonna hook you up with a psychiatrist who will work with you on an ongoing basis to help you get your center strong. And it's not gonna be just after the show but you're going to have access to her on a continuing basis because I want you to be somebody. Do you understand what I'm saying? I don't want to, you to feel like you have to take orders and rules from a guy who doesn't quite have his stuff together yet. I want you to have your stuff together on your own. Are you going to, uh, uh, if I give you access to that for free, will you take it? Yes, I would, Your Honor. Yeah because I see great things for you. It's just a matter of you reaching out and touching them. You with me? Yes, I am. Be a better person. <laughs> Do you understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Don't. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> you see the difference? There will be no recovery in this matter. It is so ordered. Good luck to you, sweetie. Yeah. Everything's gonna be fine. You've got all the power in the world because you're young and you're smart and you're beautiful. And, and you know, tell him when to step off. You eat your vegetables and fruit just like you like it. I don't let him tell you what to eat and do. You hear me? Yeah. I don't know about you. <laughs> I'm not, I don't know whether to like you or not. I'm kind of, kind of falling for you a bit, <laughs> but I'm not sure why. 